second and eight. Brady under pressure and going down. That ball loose. There is a scramble and Miami has it. Cameron Wake with the initial hit. There's a lot of people though, Tom, that are, are doubting you. Do you feel like you're past your prime? You remember Tom Brady missing some throws down? Yeah, when they up. went deep, they don't really have that guy that goes long anymore. And, and when they do, it seems like Brady's not on the same page. He missed a lot of throws in this game. The problem I have is with all these apologists out here who act like it's blasphemous to say that Tom Brady has been bad. To, put, to place blame at the feet of Tom Brady. He's a big boy, he can handle it. He is part of the problem. The way that you're gonna beat the Patriots is to affect the quarterback. Brady right? just trying to make a play. And he is so frustrated at this point. Patriots can't block anybody today. That is gonna be one long offensive line beating tomorrow. Now I see the stat that Tom Brady is the worst in the league on accuracy to this point through three games. 27% of his passes are termed missed throws so far. That's underthrows or overthrows. 27%. We're talking about Tom Brady here. Brady guns it down the middle. Pick up. That's awful. Absolutely awful. There's going to be some loud music out there. There's going to be people questioning play calling, personnel grouping. That's not going to go away until you fix it. For four weeks now, he hasn't played up to his standards, hasn't looked comfortable, is missing uh, reads like we just saw there. Tom Brady was benched for his ineffective play. Garoppolo got in there and moved the ball downfield and got the ball in the end zone. If this continues on for another five or six weeks, believe the rumblings will start that this could be Tom Brady's last year in the week. I put it out there first. Okay. If you don't understand. Tom Brady's last year in the ring. Is it time to say adios to Tommy? It is time to wave goodbye to Tom Brady. I know it's hard to do, but just tip the name off the back of the jersey and look at the production. It hasn't been there. You heard the guys mentioning the offensive line play has been bad. It's not very accurate right now. There are so many issues there. I don't know what's going on. It ends up being question of what's going on with Tom Brady, and I can't answer it because it's not just physical stuff. It's mental, too, and, and everything's coming together. And, uh, you know, we can blame it and say it starts with the offensive line, which it always does, but there's a lot of other issues with this team right now. Tom Brady threw two interceptions and was pulled in the fourth quarter. Both his ability and future were questioned. All right, gentlemen, let's start with the Sunday night game where the New England Patriots now have to welcome this 3-0 Bengals, which means undefeated. I'm worried because in this matchup last year, the Bengals held the Patriots to six points, and this Bengals defense so far has been better than they were a year ago. They're just the, the Bengals are simply the better team, and in this instance, I'm picking the better team. Bengals, and I'm with them. I do not understand how this is a pick'em. What about you, Alex? Yeah, gotta take the Bengals. What I've seen is basically the Patriots' season is over. Patriots' season, season is over. Is over. It's been a lot of fun. Play the league. It works on the networks. Back to set. Tom Brady slipping. He's any good anymore? I want to ask you, when you look in the mirror, like you got football or football? Well, you can tell everybody. Yeah, you can tell everybody. Go ahead and tell everybody. I'm the man, I'm the man, I'm the man. Well, you can tell everybody. Yeah, you can tell everybody. Go ahead and tell everybody. I'm the man, I'm the man, I'm the man.
everybody. Yeah, you can tell everybody. Go ahead and tell everybody. I'm the man, I'm the man, I'm the man. Well, you can tell everybody. Flacco has had Tom Brady's number the last couple of times uh, they've met in the playoffs. Now, two out of the last three times. Three times up there in New England, they've gotten the better of the Patriots. They've won two of them, but they've been the better team three times. So I'm going to go with the Ravens to get the upset over the Patriots. Both these gentlemen have played in the playoffs. The numbers are skewed heavily to Joe Flacco. There's uh, January Joe, Jersey Joe, and one of the best quarterbacks in football. Take it to him, the bootleg to the right. The pass is caught. Aiken makes the catch. And Aiken takes it all the way into the end zone for a touchdown. Over the middle, juggled and caught for the touchdown by Steve Smith. And the Baltimore Ravens have had the ball twice, have gone down the field twice. These people, that defense, they're expecting 12 to bail them out. Let's not do it. The skinny beanpole of a young man walked over to me and said, Hi, Mr. Kraft, I want to introduce myself. I'm Tom Brady. I said, I know who you are. You're our six-round draft choice. And I always remember he looked me like a laser eye to eye. And he said, that's right. And I'm the best decision this organization has ever made. Play action. Brady steps up. Fires caught. Gronkowski. He beats the Patriots now on a second down and goal. Oh, to the right. Brady stepping up. Heading for the end zone. Touchdown. are not going to be able to run the they're ball not, on this they're not going to be able to run the ball on this defense look cam fleming he came in he played in 38 snaps early okay in that game week 11. i don't think they're going to be able to do that brian stork is banged up the patriots are not going to be able to run the football as well as they have in the past against the Colts. their defense is playing much better they're healthier are they corey Redding? and let me sh shed another little more okay nugget here okay all right guess what they've been hearing all week long Patriots are going to line Patriots, up and run the football. You can't stop the run. Gonna Guess run what Chuck Pagano's been showing them? Video of yes. Garrett Blunt going nuts. 
video of Jonas Gray going nuts. So all week long, it's been festering and it's building this Colts defense. They're ready to stop the run. Tom Brady might throw for 400 yards, but they're not going <laughs> to run for 100 yards as a team, that's for sure. <laughs>